Okay, thank you. You're welcome. We're live. At this time, will all sergeants please start recordings? According to the computer, PC recording all set. Cloud is rolling. Backup is rolling. Good morning and welcome to today's remote New York City Council hearing for the Committee on Rules, Privileges, and Elections. At this time, would all panelists please turn on their videos for verification purposes? And to uh, minimize disruptions, please place all electronic devices to vibrate or silent mode. Thank you for your cooperation, Chair Kozlowitz. We are ready to begin. Thank you. Good morning and welcome to the Committee on Rules, Privileges, and Elections. My name is Karen Kozlowitz and I am chair of this committee. <clears throat> Before we begin this hearing, I would like to introduce the council members of this committee who have joined us today. <clears throat> uh, Minority Leader Stephen Matteo, Council Member Adrian Adams, <clears throat> Council Member <clears throat> Mark Richen, Council Member Keith Powers, Council Member Deborah Rose, Council Member Mark Traeger, <clears throat> and um, do I see Paul Vallone? It's Paul, oh, here he is, okay, and Council Member Paul Vallone. And we'll, I. Be <clears throat> and we'll be joined later by the Speaker of the City Council, Paul Richardson. <clears throat> I would also like to acknowledge Ruth's Committee Council, Lance Palufi, and the staff members of the Council's Legislative Unit, Chuck Davis, Chief Compliance Officer, and Investigators Andre Johnson Brown, Alicia Vassell, Desiree Robinson, and Ramses Uten. <clears throat> today, today, the Rules Committee will consider certain changes to the membership and chairmanships of the standing committees of the council. Pursuant to rule 10.20 of the rules of the city council, the committee on rules, privileges and elections can recommend an amendment to any rule of the council with a later vote of the majority of all council members. Today, we are hearing a pre-considered resolution to amend rule 7.00A by changing the membership and chairmanships of certain standing committees of the council. This rule change requires a majority vote of all members of the rules committee and a majority vote of the all council members. The changes proposed in the Preconsider resolution R. Uh, Eric Zinowitz being taken off of consumer affairs, Feliz taken off of finance, fire and emergency management, removing Levine, general welfare, <clears throat> removing Feliz and Traeger, mental health, disabilities, and addiction, removing Cabrera, parks and recreation. Caprera is going to be on that committee. Eric Dinowich is going to be the chair of veterans. Women and gender equity is going to be joined by Lewis and Rosenthal. <clears throat> Do any members have any questions or comments about the proposed rule changes? Do we have any? <clears throat> I don't no, see any. Okay. Okay. Now I'll now call upon the clerk to take the vote on preconsidered resolution 1630. Good morning, William Martin, committee <laughs> clerk, roll call vote committee on rules, privileges, and elections. Chair Kozlowitz. I vote aye. Chin. I have a lie. Rose. Aye. Traeger. Aye. Valone. Aye. Adams. Aye. Powers. 
Aye. Matteo. Yes. We have a vote of eight in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. Pre-considered resolution has been adopted by the committee. Mm -hmm. Council, do we keep the vote open? Yes, we will keep the vote open for the speaker. Okay. <clears throat> Good morning, Mr. Speaker. Good morning. Good morning. A roll call vote on reconsidered resolution. I vote aye on all. Thank you to Chair Kozlowitz. Thank you to the speaker. Thank you. Final is nine in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. Today's meeting of the com committee on rules, privileges, and elections is hereby.